everyone, welcome to YG Cards, and today we have the brand new 2023-2024 Upper Deck Black Diamond Hockey, continuing the Connor Bedard rookie product trend here with, I guess, maybe the first higher-end product for his rookie year, 2023-2024, and that is Black Diamond, so we've got six premium cards per box. Unfortunately, not guaranteed an auto in here, um, guaranteed an autograph or a diamond card, as well as additional parallels and mem cards some flagship cards in this product we have the jewels of the draft which is really nice that's actually one of the few i guess key patch auto cards that you can get sticker auto nonetheless other diamond cards are obviously well known in this product i think they're quite gimmicky but diamonds nonetheless single double triple and quad diamonds of a lot of the rookie players in here of the 23 24 crop including Bedard. We have the team logo jumbos. That is a manufactured patch, but is a common hit in this product. And we have other cards like the gemography, which actually look really nice. Band of color cards as well. And then we have the exquisite collection cards in here. So that's typically a patch card, or that can just be a thicky that's numbered. <laughs> and there's, you know, no jersey or auto on it as well. But it is the first product of the year. First of three, I believe, that have the exquisite cards in the product. The other two being ice and the cup. So yeah, folks, why don't we just dive right into this? Obviously looking to hit Bedard. He's the main Chase in here uh, behind Lou Carlson and Fantilli, I would say. Yeah, I, I've got this box for decent price uh, pre release, which is around 399 or 400 US. I know it's a lot higher now, <laughs> 500 US or higher. Here is our box. So, similar size of box to last year. That is a really thick pack. There's an empty box. I actually quite like the look of the, the pack and the product. Let's get this open, folks. That feels really thick, to be, to be quite honest. So, like I said, six pack cards in this pack let's open it this way so we don't reveal the back card so there we have a bunch of thick ones so we're gonna reveal the first card here there's tage thompson okay that's actually a really nice looking base card that's a 75 red okay that kind of looks like a jewels of the no that's a band of color cards so why don't we reveal that next all these cards are so thick okay behind here block diamond Okay, out of Fantilli, nice, okay. It's Rookie's Band of Color to 24, nice. Well, that's of a good player. Uh, definitely one of the top rookies you wanna get in this product is Adam Fantilli, Band of Color to 24, that's sick. Okay, so I don't know if we maybe go from the back here, folks. I don't know if we go from the back here. Do this here. Oh, it's an exquisite tandems. Okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, so it's Mike Bossy and Brent Chartier. So there's a collection, okay. I guess this, the, the, your exquisite card doesn't have to be a rookie. It can be, well, could be a current player or it can be retired stars like this one. That's the 99. So the numbering in the center, they're 97, 99. Nice card there, okay. I will say the cards do look really sharp here. The next one behind that one on the back, we have a... Okay, it's Sean Farrell Rookie Gems to 399. It's Sean Farrell, okay. Nice looking card there. I have to say, yeah, the design actually does look very appealing. Um, the edges and corners, especially the thick cards, yeah, kind of doesn't look perfect, but uh, okay, folks, let's see what we get here. This is, uh, okay, this looks like a Black Lusses Rookie card in the back. I don't know, what, what should we do next? Maybe go from the back here. So Black Diamond. Nashville, okay, Philip Forsberg, Diamond Mine Relics, okay. All right, that's a jersey piece there, but Philip Forsberg, Nashville Predators, all right. So I think it's the third card that's in the pack that is usually the hit. Maybe that's the main hit. I mean, that's a pretty solid card, the Band of Color, but you have what looks like to be a, this Black Diamond, maybe this is a Pizzas Patch card, perhaps? I don't know, folks. What's one of these, like, maybe Jumbo cards? Red, well, that's this is Chicago color. <laughs> Team Jumbo logos, oh, that looks like Detroit, actually. Okay, that's cool. Marco Casper, okay, Team Logos Jumbo. All right. I thought it might have been like a Black Lusters card because of the, because it's kind of like the white and the black design, but that, okay, that's a team logo jumbo of Marco Casper there for the Detroit Red Wings. Okay. Okay, folks, well, there's our box. I mean, this did end up being the, I guess, a hit of the box because it's, I guess there's diamonds in here. I, I don't know if all the Band of Color cards have the diamond. Yeah, they do. All, all the Band of Color cards do have the diamond. So these are, I just realized, they're very hard to hit. So <laughs> so we did actually hit a very hard card to get and we got of a solid player. So that was the hit of the box right off the bat out of 24. So yeah, I guess all the diamond diamonds i'll say i don't know that could be from the dollar store who knows they are all of a different color and the color of the rainbow so that is the main hit of the box there anna fantilli number 24 really look nice looking card we got a team logo jumbos card of marco casper diamond mine relic philip forsberg a rookie gem sean farrell cool exquisite tandems card of trotty and bossy to 99 and then we have the tage thompson base set of 75 all right folks there you have it that's our one box of black diamond lay yeah, let me know what you think of the product i mean I, I still think it's pretty overpriced but unless you get a fantilli or leo carlson and orbidar obviously it's worth it. But other than that, it's uh, quite the gamble, folks. So yeah, let me know what you think of the product and stay tuned for more breaks to come on the channel. Thanks for watching.